All right, welcome back to the Ela Show streaming live on channel 408 Tea Time. And of course, I am still with my co anchors, Big Bay and Cookie. Yeah, <laughs> thank you. Okay, so, um, this particular story is, um, I don't know, should I say, I don't know what to just say, but let me let me spill the tea. Okay, so Nigerian singer Olua Toby. One day Ojo Sipe, popularly known as Wandeko, has declared himself the best artist in the country. Mm. Now, Wandeko, who is yet to have a hit song in many years, said <laughs> it is undebatable that he is the best artist in the country, regardless. Now, the bomber to bomber. Krona stated this via his Twitter handle on Friday. He said whether he is regarded as a legend or not, he remains the best artist the country has ever seen. Now, the 37-year-old vocalist wrote, I repeat, I am the best artist, no debating. The singer recently unveiled the track list of his 13-track album, Legend or No Legend, which features... Um, Olamide, Whiskey, and American rapper T Pain. Okay, so before I share, before I would, um, you know, share my own opinion <laughs> on this, Bingpe, what do you think? Okay, like he said, is the best artist, no debate. Yeah, for me, like his vocals are, his vocals game is a game, like top notch, hundred percent. He can switch from a soprano high pitch to a deep bass, um, deep baritone voice. So. Talking about, let's leave each song aside, is the best. I was discussing with my siblings, I think a few days ago, that I've not seen a male artist that can still beat his vocals. Like, like, coming from the female artist, I'll go for Simi. Simi is the best uh, vocal. Simi can switch from soprano to alto. But Wandiko can go through all around the soprano, alto, tenor, bass. Like, his vocals are very, very strong. So let's leave the, if we're talking about each song, I can still say, okay, well, what are you talking about, Baba? But then his vocals, like they said, he's a vocalist. I, I'm still wondering why they didn't put him on some um, um, vocal show, like um, voice. I expected them to bring him on because. Okay, no. as part of the judges. Yeah, because he's very, very, very good. To me, he's very, very good. No debate, he's the best artist in Nigeria. Hmm. Yes. Hmm. Okay, cookie. <laughs> For me, you see. Um, for him, I think something must have prompted him to say, oh yeah, I'm the best artist in Nigeria. Probably some kind of disrespect that happened and just felt the need to like voice and felt that was the best way to word his thought at that moment. But for me, <clears throat> this is 2023. Ogawa and Deko, sorry. Sorry, sorry. To you, fine. No, mother has the same. Uh, should I be saying my mother's uh, my mother's cooking is the best in the whole world? Yeah. It's not, it's <laughs> yeah, not yeah. Said that I've, other people. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But to him, is actually the best. But to be sincere, to be factual, based on facts, based on reality, sorry, so you are at the moment, no. Because right now, for you to, to claim the title, oh, you're the best artist in this, there's some things you need to achieve. Probably your charts, your streams, your sales, your digitals, and everything. Like, these things matters. And right now, I think wherever his position is on those things I mentioned, is probably like, probably be. Probably average or below average. So <laughs> I don't I don't know where the best is coming from. Now coming final. from the legend, he said mm -hmm. legend. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. His last song was 2019. That was the last song of um, this song that was trending on TikTok. Gentility. I, oh yeah, TikTok brought it back last. Yeah, year. and TikTok now. So many people will be thinking, ah, that song was maybe mm -hmm. the in maybe recent. Let me tell mm -hmm. you guys, you know, it's 2019. So aside from that song, I have not really seen any um, song from him, and he claims that, or he's claiming, he claims that he's the best. Um, a male artist, artist in, in Nigeria. In Nigeria. Yeah. What happens to Rema, whose chart is, <laughs> whose chart is, you know, it topping every is, is single is day? Is the IS like, bit yes, on the Billboard 800. Oh, it's not yeah, yeah, it's five. Yeah, it's I number five. I mean, the way things are going. Oh, oh, okay. Okay. okay, let's leave it so that's like, if, if, if he's coming out to say, okay, I'm the best vocalist, oh, can mm -hmm. he say, okay, oh. Yeah. But then, no, he's artist. saying artist. So, I just want to put it to him that, sorry, bro, you are not, because we have Rema. And very soon, with the way things are going sorry whiskey fc i'm going to say this with the way things are going rema is going to beat whiskey hands down he has take it or leave okay. it yeah he's, <laughs> no, he's, getting, he's, getting, he's, there. he's yeah. getting there take it or leave it he's going to beat whiskey hands and down. i because think because you cannot be in the game forever 
Look at yeah. Oga Don Jazzy now. In his yes. days, it was Baba Bon. Look at him now. I love the fact that he's grooming the young, the wow. young, uh, yeah, the he's grooming them now. So I feel some people you cannot be in the chat fire. So don't take it as an offense, like he said. Mm -hmm. I'm also like I love whiskey. I love the video. So whiskey, the FC should not take it as an offense. Like you cannot be in the game forever. <laughs> so let the new people come up and mm -hmm. yeah. But I like the fact that he has a new um, album coming up and mm -hmm. he he has featured um, great um, you know artists, Access. the likes of Olamide. I mean, if you're calling yourself the best um, artist, what happens to Olamide? Um. Bado. <laughs> like, well, so where do we want to put, where mm. where are we going to put it? What because happens I think they literally start almost the same time. Yeah, they start mm. almost the same time. And, oh, and no, when it comes to the uh, no, uh, area, area, but don't like, the don't the um, area. Um, don't the the era. Era. Yeah, yeah, don't just the, the band. And yeah. all that, yeah, you mentioned the band. What happens to the band? Because mm. no, the, the band can he's a mm. very good, he's he's a very good, good with his baritone voice. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he's good. Mm -hmm. So, what happens to day. all those people? <laughs> and uh, whiskey, we, uh, even though whiskey, well, yeah, whiskey is still, is still good. he's still, he's still, he's it's, still it's good, fair, and all, fair. yeah. So, sorry, yeah, to you, you are, but when if we are talking about chat base and um. Um, songs. Hit songs and no, sorry, bro, you're not on the list. Oh, oh yeah, I'm so sorry. If you if you'd retire, <laughs> no, 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 if you group people like 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 you know, no, look at like, Olamide like, and Don Jazzy like now, they are grooming people yeah, to they become are. the best. So they yeah. should groom. People. But you know, the, they say the truth always hurts. I will still say to you, you are not the best. Well, when it comes, when when it comes to music. vocals hey, and no, all. No, nobody is talking you, about sir. vocals. Yeah, he's talking about being <laughs> the best artist. Mm, like, how? How? No, you're not. Rema is even trying. Rema is, as for me, Rema is the best for now. <laughs> now, speaking, <laughs> <laughs> now, talking about the best artists. This mm. one for me is the best artist. As mm. Mm. Argue, mm. argue with your keyboard. Mm. Mm. <laughs> argue with your keyboard now. Award winning Nigerian singer David Adeleke, popularly known as Davido, has announced a new series on global streaming giant Netflix. He made this known during an interview with a Dubai based media house. Now, according to Davido, the doc series um, titled David Focuses on His Life, the hit um, singer who recently released the new album timeless revealed that the movie will be out in december with netflix and it promises to be very big speaking about the project for the first time the singer revealed it's a documentary a doc series about his life called david and set to hit the big screens on netflix in december yeah i'm really really looking forward to um this project we've had lots of um celebrities who also have their own documentaries on netflix and i think this is going to be a very this is going to be a very big fit for davido mm -hmm. yeah what do you guys think yeah i mean it's going to be a very big one according to i said according compared to all the circumstances that have happened yeah. people will get to know him more, more yeah. and it has its, its own advantages and disadvantages but then mm -hmm. we are looking forward to to see the Dog series yeah. now. But try to know what she said. You know, the title of the doc series is like um focuses on his life. So I think um compared to probably the David o we know, the mm. David o we all see, there's still some sides to him that we don't know and it's probably hopeful to like share those things with us. So we are really hopeful and we can't wait for December to come so we get to see what he has in yeah. store for us. Yeah, we have we've had um um celebrities like Selena Gomez who um had her own doc series on netflix we've had um other selling we've had even um the issue with the oscar slap and all oh, oh yeah, yeah, Chris Rock. Chris yeah, Rock. yeah. Not, not only not only actors not only singers release doc series like um comedians comedians so just released yeah, yes so just it's released a good one, one for him yeah it's a good one for him and i hope that with this doc series people will get to understand why obio it's it's Obi -Obi. Obi -Obi. Yeah. <laughs> and the game why he's in the game so this series will open it's, it's going to shed more light on his mm -hmm. life and everything about him from when he started music and um to where he's going so i think um before we end today's um show we need to take one more story hmm. yes um the story okay reality tv star this is on big brother Hmm. Reality TV star Leo hmm. Da Silva is of the opinion that a relationship might pack up if one partner who has never traveled abroad does. 
he wrote if you're dating someone that has never traveled abroad and they eventually do there's every possibility your relationship is over immediately they do <clears throat> this is where i sip my tea <laughs> because i always say big brother ninja graduates and sense is far from it they are like see they are like this because they keep saying i'm things going to that, stop okay. you on that you can't say hey. no 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 hey. 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 About are hey. far from that. I, what about the likes of ebuka Exactly. What about the likes of Ebuka? Are you no, saying I'm Ebuka? Not saying, I'm not saying you Ebuka. Can say, I'm not saying You can say some. You can say most. If you're saying all, you're saying the rate at which, and senses. The, the rate at that which... That means you are, you are I'm not generalizing them. Exactly. Them. So don't generalize. Okay. Yes, the, 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 yes, some. Some. Some big brother graduates, rather. <laughs> the, way, the way these people... The way these people... Most especially those who didn't even do anything phenomenal on oh, the man. show. Yeesh. The way they come out oh, and... The way they just come out and say things... I, I, this social media air eh, has given room to so many people that don't even have intellect to just <gasps> come out and say things. That was the mean, like, what? Oh, be nice. No. <laughs> no, you can't. No. Okay, I'm, I'm going to put it this way. Okay. I feel most people, don't let me say some people. Okay, let me say some people, let me say most. They judge situations according to what has happened in their life. So, because this thing happen to you maybe him or somebody around you. maybe because they were cutting and the person traveled and that was the end for the relation doesn't mean that's how all relationships can be as since we've seen relationships whereby they are long distance and it worked really well and maybe after a few months or few years the partner traveled to meet the partner, the partner. And, and they've always been good ever since they got married and all so you come out and say okay you've never traveled before once your partner travel it is over i oh, speak for yourself like you should speak for yourself at least there are people who, for even even in the country that people who engage in long distance relationship mm -hmm. and they are fine so please what was with the the relationship is over once the traveler and everything please it's please. not it. It's not it. Yeah. Please speak for yourself. Let us know the breakfast they served you. <laughs> <laughs> so Probably it's coming from the place, place of pain. Hey. Go straight. Hey. Don't go through the corners. Yeah. Like go I straight. said, like I said, your opinion it's just like um this other person who has a podcast and is always coming mm. out <laughs> saying things that are not even 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 if some people going there. yes most of these big brother graduates are always, are always going, going there, there. Why? And Why? So, even if people are of the opinion that most times what he says are really the same and all oh, i'll still say that if if anything if something personal has happened to you state, state it. just mm -hmm. just don't generalize yeah. it because what he's doing is trying to generalize mm -hmm. it so that means you're trying to tell people that if you take your partner out outside of the country like if your partner uh, yeah, travels, out, travels out, out and the next thing I don't person so what's going to say about you know? people that are in the same country and the relationship still in yes mm -hmm. and the relationship so don't, don't work so like I, like I would say just stick to your problems and don't bring your problems on social media and come and generalize it you could have just asked for people's opinions yeah. rather than just generalizing, just generalizing. And nobody cares hey. truth hey. be told hey. okay so this is where we draw the cutscene for today but thank you for watching as always join the conversation on social media with the hashtag tea time and remember you can catch up on all our previous episodes including this very well on our exclusive content by subscribing to our youtube channel at plus tv africa lifestyle you can also watch tea time on r2 tv and in london on ben television and star times channel 308 a very big thank you goes to my co-anchor Bingpei and Cookie. Yeah, thank you guys yeah. for holding me down. And to the production team, I'm saying thank you to AJ and every other person who were at the back punching all the buttons. The, my name still remains Uyime Elijah and this is me saying goodbye. Bye.